Hi guys, so today is Saturday and we're going to Joburg. My husband's taking me to Joburg for a few days. I think we're going to come back on Monday. Um, going to be two stones, two birds. <laughs> two beds, guess I guess. Two birds with one stone. Do a bit of work and also be able to just enjoy some time away from home. So yeah, that's what's going to be happening in this vlog. And I have the biggest pimple on my lip. It's so painful. Mm. Guys, I don't know what to do with my skin at this point. Anyway, so this is me. So I'll just be taking you guys through uh, the whole journey. As you know, how we do it in this household. Anyway, yeah. Okay, I'll see you guys just now. So because I'm starving, we just stopped here at KFC. At Oshuk to get some food. Well, just a snack burger and water because I don't want to overeat. I don't even know what I'm gonna have. some jeans and stuff and it will look very very nice I like it this is a size medium okay let's fit on something else <laughs> feel about it but maybe with like a nice pair of jeans it would look nice obviously there's this underneath so i'm gonna put a bra on it would look it would look very nice okay let's try on something else Is it 
That's bad. trip so anyway yeah so now we are at Santon city i just want to get something it's a birthday present from me to me so i'll take you guys on that i don't think i'm going to be able to shoot inside the shop because first of all i've got like a little anxiety when people are watching me um especially because it's my phone maybe when it's a camera i'd be like oh, okay cool you know vloggers you know what i mean but because it's my phone i just feel like it's so you know what i mean and maybe that's me. I'll see. Why are you worried about people doing it? That what? Why are you worried about people who won't contribute anything in that? I don't know. I think it's just a thing. I don't know. Maybe I won't be worried. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, let me take you guys don't with have that. The thing. Huh? You don't have the thing. I shouldn't have it. Yeah, just do it. Just do it. I always ask you to take um footage of me because you know my arms are already tired from doing this already. Anyway, I'll take you guys with me to Ark as well. I want to get some makeup products um, that we don't have in Swaziland. See, you, this lady's looking at me, but I don't care. <laughs> okay, guys, yeah, so I literally went to the bathroom just to show you guys my fit. But anyway, this is what I'm wearing today. Shoes from Woolies, jeans from Zara, top or half jersey thing from H&M. So guys, we are at sports scene and I don't know if I should take this one or this one. Or this one. I really really like these. I don't know. But these are 675 rand off. So these make more financial sense. So I think I'm gonna go with these ones. Plus they black so I can wear them at any time. So I think I'm gonna go with these ones. So someone decided to buy sneakers and change. Bo ga gusa fika. Ko te te ku muka ako. Anta cute. Say la pi wulis man je say ngena la pa. Yeah, but here we are at Ark. Just wanna go and get some stuff. So I want to try out the Huda Beauty foundation, but the problem is I've got foundation on, but the lady says she's going to help, she's going to do a swash, so maybe we're going to try and take footage of that <laughs> and see if I get my color because everyone's raving about Huda and I've never tried it. So, also, how gorgeous is my husband, baby? Liva, say hi. <laughs> How many times? As much as possible because. No, Jella, Londi. Londi. It's so clean. Okay. You wanna wrap it with your finger? No, 
I like it, but let me take one shade lighter. Let's we'll see what happens. Okay, guys. So let me just show you what I got from the ARC real quick. I got this uh, Goof Proof Brow Pencil from Benefits. Um, it's so cool, like the packaging. And they did show me like how like the pigment is very, very pigmented. So yeah. And then I got this also, it's called the Gogo -Go Tint. This is like a highlighter, but I'll show you guys once I get home. Maybe I'll do like a whole tutorial. Um, using my new products this is the gogo -Go tint um highlighter from also from benefits and then what else I, get? I got the huda beauty i don't know if this is the right way to put it huda beauty um luminous matte full coverage liquid foundation can't wait to try it out and then i got the fenty beauty um what is this? Instant Retouch Concealer. Can't wait to use that. Like, I was just so tired of having my makeup, like, all crusty sometimes. I don't like that. Anastasia Stick Highlighter. Oh, this is not a highlighter. This is a um, liquid blush. And then I got this um, highlighter. I don't like that, guys. The pressure. I did not know this was so expensive. I just took it because I saw like this little package and I was like, oh, okay, cool. Maybe this is like 200 bucks. This thing, 650 dungeon. Okay, I think that's about it from um, Arc. So yeah, can't wait to try it out. I'll probably um, get home and just try and beat my face with this and just see What's the fuss about with the Huda Beauty and everything? Cool stuff. Okay, guys. So we just uh, checked in. Uh, it's around 7.15 because we started somewhere before we got here. So also, like, how ratchet my nail. But anyway, I uh, just want to give you guys a room tour of where we are sleeping. This place is called the Courtyard. Courtyard what? Got to be in Waterfall. Hmm? Courtyard City yeah. in Kailami. Um, so yeah, I just want to give you guys um, a room tour of how gorgeous this place is. So this is the bathroom. The lighting in here is insane. Also, this is Samsung. Pretty much like you know, and just back to square word, back to factory settings. Okay, cool. Let me just uh, give you guys a room tour. So this is are we? This is the bathroom. This is how it looks. Oh, I love the mirror. I literally feel like I should take it home with me. <laughs> and this is the shower. And it's just nice and cute. But I really like, you should see this place in person, guys. It's so nice. And then this is uh, the actual room. It's got like, um, are you okay, babe? I can come through. Okay. So this is the place. I love how they literally are very minimalistic and they used like the whole space. Like they used this um, as like a decor around the TV, like a TV stand type thing. But they also, you could also hang like your stuff over there. So that's quite cute. Oh, here's a mini bar. I hope there's stuff in here that we could, you know, there's just water and some juice. And then they have a coffee machine. This I can use for some, like a nice reel <laughs> before I leave. They even have like these nice cups that we could use. You'll see this up, Kesanas. Don't ask me questions about where is this? You know where it is. Okay. So they have like a little couch that's like nice. I don't like how hotels just give you like a bed and forget that you can have like times where you don't want to sit on the bed. So this is very nice. And they have like a study desk type thing. Well, this is going to be used as a makeup station, as you know, your girl. And it's mirrors everywhere, guys. If your house doesn't have mirrors, I don't know what you're doing. And then this is the bed. I like this whole, I don't know what it is, but this vibe is, is very nice. And then it's just a nice uh, bed, uh, husband, 
<laughs> it's very cute guys i really really like it um and then yeah here's another mirror showing you guys the whole of me loves <laughs> okay so yeah this is how the place looks uh we just got here now going to take a shower and probably think if we want to like stay in or go out it is sunday so but sunday go jobig is like a fryer so i don't think there's going to be much of a difference there in terms of things to do but gisuti so they i'm not feeling like going out for food but the places really that are hip and happening are like the food places that turn into joints at night <laughs> so anyway guys love and leave you guys i think oh you know what i think i'm going to do like um single single cookie lemon look hmm maybe i'll just do like a mini unboxing uh bef because there's so much more nicer lighting here than the other place that we were staying at yesterday so yeah okay cool let me stop rambling and wrap this up also, I forgot to show you guys the view from up here. Oh my god. Like, I just want to stay here forever. Guys, I'm going to direct me to that place. I'm going to go to that place. I'm going to go to that place. Like, look at this. Anyway, let us just go back and hustle because this is the life that we should be living on a daily basis guys this can't be a once in a lifetime thing this kind of happened every time i turn 30 because i turned 30 once <laughs> guys, so it's day three right yeah day three on Saturday. it's day three and we are checking out of our second location and then we're going to go have breakfast now at four. Hopefully it's not four because apparently a friend of mine told me Guti the last time she went, um, there was a line, there was a queue outside just to go in. So hopefully we don't have to go through that. But anyway, we were supposed to leave today, but um, Eva has something to do in Pretoria tomorrow. So we're going to be staying another day and maybe I'll get to see my friend for now. So I just got to the car and I realized that um, I didn't put any lashes on. So I don't know if I should try and put them on in the car or just leave this look like this. It's not bad though, but in general. Also, I used the, what's it called again? Huda Beauty um, foundation today. I really, really like it. I love the finish. It's like, it gives you that glowy finish. And also, I literally just um, blended it once and it went through like, I didn't even have to go through it like twice. It went through like immediately. Um, I think the only problem is that I got a concealer that's not too light, the one from Fenty. Um, it's a shade lighter but it just kind of blends into my skin instead of like popping so i had to use your guys i need to do my nails um i had to add on the elego pro concealer uh, just to give it a bit of light but i'm really really happy with um how it came off but i don't know i feel like i need to practice 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 until i get it right so yeah okay I'll catch you guys at breakfast. So we just got to Marco. And I want to get a few stuff for the food hat, as I have mentioned, because there's a few changes that we're going to be making. So this is part of the change. <laughs> You'll see. I just want to get like some minutes. heaters and... 20 minutes. But unfortunately, we're not using a van, so I don't even know how to do the But anyway. So I'm going to get these heaters. I'm gonna get two of them. So here they are, these two boxes, because 
we are about to heat up the food hut. Okay, so I am happy because we were able to get a few stuff and it did fit in the car even though the car looks like this. <laughs> I don't know how Lufa's going to be driving without seeing the back, but... I really, really am dreading the whole um, border process. Uh, guys, there should be a simpler way to do it because honestly, it's the worst thing just having to declare things and them telling you you made a mistake somewhere and, 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 and they, you can never get it right. They will tell you, next time you do it, put your tax invoice, what, what, put your TIN number, you do it, they'll find another problem they will always be a problem no wonder there's trucks lined up like crazy anyway um so i think um we might leave today because Lifa might get um what he wanted here and today but i will update you guys but i think this will be the end of this vlog i don't think there'll be much to vlog after this but thank you guys for tuning in and i think i'll be dropping it very soon until we meet again